Hello everyone and welcome back to Command and Destroy and welcome to the second mission for the aliens, Invasion. Let's see how much oil we have to harness this time. I'm not quite sure why the aliens use oil, I mean, I, I can see why people use oil, but they do have like lasers and UFOs, it just doesn't, it, it feels like there's a disconnect, they should use, I don't know, fusion power, so. It is time to test our army, find and eliminate all enemy troops. We recommend you use the airborne robojet unit since it can transverse all types of terrain and obstacles. Let's see, new units available, the robojet, mission objectives, eliminate all troops and construct robojet units. We can do that, I suppose. So first things first, let's try to find some oil. Maybe you can move out a little bit as well. You come over here. I guess, do I still need a transmitter? I guess I do. I'm kind of curious about that, whether the transmitter only provides with unit, but they say that it also converts the oil to money. So I, I guess I'm still gonna need it. Also, where, where is the oil, please? In any case, you please out this terrain here because this looks awful just this black column here and you come over here and okay, nothing here it appears great the humans are already here and they're outnumbering me okay so here's the oil that's good to know so you come over here we do have 5,000 credits that's actually a pretty pretty decent amount oh, that's, so that's not so hard because now our troops are split up please come over here so let's just hang out here and try to do this with defender's advantage. Otherwise they're gonna get us straight away here. Oh, that's not good. Oh hey, you did squish that guy, congratulations. Okay, you try to take out that guy and let's hope you survive long enough. I'm not gonna place a transmitter before this guy here gets up and running because I'm kind of curious whether we get the money in any case, or we really need the transmitter. No, it doesn't look like we're gonna get any income, so transmitter it is then. Yeah, there we go, we immediately get money. Let's get a breed pod to breed some jump jet troopers, I guess. I know they're not called that, they're called robo jets. Like, come on, you, you know what I mean. Here's some gigantic mammoth tusks, or whatever that is actually supposed to be. Uh, let's see. Maybe we can also find a second, second oil patch since we... How expensive are you? Uh, quite a bit more expensive, so let's maybe get a bunch of these guys here for the time being. Just because they're cheap and we may as well use them. I mean, maybe there's some sort of advantage to utilizing the jump jet trooper. Maybe we can attack the human's headquarter more easily because it's... Oh, there we go. More oil here. Uh, across the water or whatever, but we'll see about that. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Where is... Oh, yeah, it did send you down here. Here we go. Good, good, good. Here's some, some humans, but it's okay. We have overwhelming firepower here. I like how the humans are mildly annoyed when they get shot. Just good. Ah! Something about that I like. So let's see then. You all just hang out here, and then let's get a bunch of you here. I assume the humans don't have any flying units yet, so we should be able to just hang out here and defend our base that way. You can explore a little bit more here. You know what? You just go north and get yourself killed sooner or later, likely. Or, or maybe not. Oh, I forgot you can't order these units to, to enter an area they can't actually reach. So they, they won't go as close as they can. Instead, they just don't move there at all. Which is not ideal, but whatever. Okay. 
Even more oil here. Do we want more income? I guess we do. In this case, maybe let's... Yeah, not do that right now. So here's our jet squad. At least these guys always seem to be flying, which makes them more useful than the Apaches in that specific regard. Okay, thumb coming all the way over here. If you can actually do that, which I'm not entirely sure you can. Nope, you sure cannot. Over here. Okay, fine, just move over here. Can you do that for me? There we go, thank you. Good, good, good. I don't think we need that much oil here, but you know what? Since it's here, we may as well grab it, and who knows how many guys are defending the human base. It's better to secure the income now than need it later when we don't have it. Especially considering the investment is fairly low. Wow, you just you just stood around there for a moment. Okay, what, what, whatever, man. That's what you want to do. I wonder whether the humans have any anti-air. It's possible that they don't have any, and then... Our jump jet troopers can just, or robo jets, can just murderize them. Okay, there we go, please. Because now you have to move all the way over there, but that's acceptable. Yeah, I'm not quite sure about the income rates compared here to the humans. Because the, the, wait, didn't I, didn't I select all of you? I thought I did. Oh, you have to select their shadows. I almost forgot about that. Otherwise, this doesn't work out. There we go. Because I... I kind of like... The, with the human economy, I like that you can just... Oh, okay, so they do have anti-air. Hey, Stinger Troopers. I guess that's not too surprising. But it's just one of you here for the time being. There we go. Even though you almost killed two of our guys here. Okay. Might still be useful to have... To, you know what, you can... I guess we could kill you here. So it's useful to just have like four guys on one oil patch. It sounds like overkill, but to be honest, in most missions, I did not run out of... Okay, I guess you, you can't target this guy here once he's, once he's unloading. I did not run out of oil for even a single oil patch. Okay, let's destroy the economy. That's probably going to kill all these jump jet troopers here because they're all too close. To the refinery, but what can you do? There we go. That's good. I like how <laughs> this guy has his rifle pointed east here, but the if he's not facing Thau, so the the laser, whatever he's firing, just kind of kind of drops out of his rifle. That's there's something cute about that. Also, these guys deal no damage, but they're not actually. For two of you, for two of these, that's like more money than you need to pay for like a medium tank. So, yeah, maybe, maybe that's not so hard. You guys, please move. Uh, are you, yeah, you are gonna move sooner or later, uh, probably later. Is this building ever going? How much health stuff this building has last? Oh, not much. That's good then. Yeah, and I really like that these guys always fly. That was, that's the pain with the Apaches. Well, I guess there's like, well, there's almost no humans left, but who cares? There we go. I mean, it's the second mission, so I guess we shouldn't expect too much here. Do the power plants actually explode violently as well, or do they just explode like regular buildings? We shall find out in the very near future. Okay, there we go, jet troopers go. Yeah, the jet troopers, they're gonna be useful if there's not too m Oh, you really re did rebuild that. Oh, you little bastard. Let's, you know what, maybe let's destroy the headquarters because otherwise this is gonna be futile. Okay, there we go. Wait, even the radar explodes violently? I did not know that was the case. Um, n no matter. Headquarters, let's bring it down, otherwise they're gonna rebuild everything constantly. Like why why did you move so why do they always have to move so close to this building? Every single time. Anyway. The headquarters are actually going down quite quickly. Then again I have more guys than ever, so I'm not sure why I'm surprised there. Do they even have a barracks? It doesn't look like it. Nope, doesn't doesn't seem like it. But yeah, all their buildings explode like the refinery does. That was not the case for the aliens, I believe. 
I don't think all buildings cause big explosions, but never mind. Okay, you please destroy that one. Forgot I had to click on the bottom there. You please, please move as well. And most of you are going to die destroying these buildings here, but that's that's how it is. Make a sacrifice for the cause. Wait for the explosion here to go away, otherwise you're going to die here soon. Are these guys weaker than my basic troopers? It seems like it, but maybe they're just worse against the building. And not worse in general. Uh, let's see about that. Or maybe not, because I may not actually use them in the future. Who knows? Oh yeah, that feels super weak. Yeah, these guys here destroyed the refinery almost in the same time that these guys used to destroy one power plant. And it seems like this does not protect you from debris. Okay, time for you to go. That hopefully will be the last thing we have to destroy here. Uh, it was not. I guess there's some human troops left here somewhere. Actually, yeah. You come over here as well. I wonder whether they have stuff on the other side that you need to reach with jump jet troopers, even though it would be weird because it's a secondary objective. Wait, was it was it not their main base? Do they have another base here? I guess we'll find out soon. Okay. Yeah, maybe they, they do have stuff on the this part of the map here. Could be. Well, someone's hanging around here. Not likely, but who knows. You check the corner here. You guys seem to be good. You come over here. And you come over here. Okay. Seems to be clear so far. Oh, there, there are some guys. I saw that already. So I guess you need to build the jump check was otherwise I don't see how you would even get over here. Unless, is there a connection here? I mean, there could be a really small corridor there, but I mean, come on. Are you actually a stinger guy? Or yeah, are you a saboteur? No, you are a stinger guy. Okay, I guess you just have to build these. Otherwise, I wouldn't know how you would even complete the mission. Goodbye. Alright, there we go, yeah, there's another one here. Okay, that's still not it. Oh, there we go, that is it. Good, 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 here are the results. 13 minutes exactly. We built all objectives because we have to do that. And yeah, that was it for the second mission, not too challenging. But we'll see how future missions will be. Thanks for watching and see you next time.